what part what what closure what closure am i wearing a closure what closure yeah you see the clothes or you're a hater you're staring too hard <laughs> it's blossom here and I was just coming in to tell you guys about my pretty much my last day of being on my pre-op diet I'm not gonna repeat everything that you know um, my diet was per se but I just want to give you guys a quick update first let me start off with my stats I have not told you guys my stats and this came to that day to where I have to tell you how fat I am so my highest weight was in December of 2017. This is when I decided that, okay, I'm either gonna lose 50 pounds. If I don't lose 50 pounds, I'll go for it with the surgery. So in December of 2016, dun, 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 I was 288 pounds. I know somebody said, damn, and you an asshole for that. I'm a woman, I'm a human, I like to eat. I told you noodles was my addiction. Anyways, so in 2017, I was going to the gym like crazy. I was in the gym for maybe like two hours in the morning. I lost 25 pounds while in the gym. So when I started my pre-op, well, for like insurance and uh, insurance approvals, how much did I weigh? I weighed 269. I weighed 269. And when I started my pre-op diet, I was still 269 because yeah, I did lose weight to get approved. But I went on the one of those things where you just binge eat all the foods that you want to eat, and I gained back the weight that you know I lost. Don't judge me for it. All right, so now on the thousand calories and the liquid diet, from that I am down 13 pounds. So with that, on the 1,000 calories, I lost, how much did I lose on that? I lost 10 pounds. And then so far on the liquid diet, I've lost uh, three pounds in one day. I actually have to weigh myself tomorrow morning because that's not completely updated. So in the morning, um, when I'm on my way to the hospital, because tomorrow is my actual surgery day, I'll give you guys a quick update on how much I'm weighing. Um, what is my goal weight? My goal weight is to be 165. I don't want to get below 160, but the ideal goal for me is 165, and that's 100 pounds for me. And I'm hoping that I'm not one of those people that loses really fast. I want to lose not slow as well, but like medium, I guess. Um, <clears throat> I'm saying I'm a lot. I'm sorry. I feel like my neighbors are watching me even though it's like this big ass pond in between my apartment and their apartment I, I it's just some of my paranoia things even if that I don't know if that's where but let's move over to the next part of this video I want to show you guys what I'm packing to go to the hospital with me it's pretty much little basic things you get to meet my teddy bear that's been across the United States because he's a boss this is my baby um yeah that's the this is the bear that i've been talking about please excuse the dirt spots on him i don't he's very sentimental to me all right so let me get into my packaging video yeah, i pretty much have all of my meds for when i go back to my hometown i have my pill organizer i have some pajamas and i have bralettes i wanted to pretty much wear something that was like mad comfortable and bralettes are like the thing to go and over here, I probably have about a week's, a week worth of clothes. I say maybe like five days dealing with me. And pretty much that's it. It's really nice. Nothing. Here is a pre-op body shot. Uh, let me go to this side. Do you like my shoes? I got them from Walmart. Boom! Baby, come give me something. Baby, come give me something. 